Dr Luca. Mr Speaker, can I praise the Road Minister for taking active interest in the A5? Because I've met with him multiple times and only last week dealing with the A5 yet again. Now, I understand why the RIS 3 programme has been pushed back. However, the A5 acts as a, a constriction around prosperity, growth and housing in our area. There are four points that are pinpointed that are narrowed on the A5. Could he let me know what they were as Highway said they would do that? And could he give us an indication of how I can move them forward to try and release this strangulation on our area? Uh, well, I'm grateful for the question uh, and, and for his kind comments about my, my honourable friend, the Roads Minister. The, the A5 between the M42 and M6 is indeed a key artery for business and for motorists, is an integral to local, local growth plans, as he said. National Highways continues to develop potential options to upgrade the route as part of the pipeline of its potential future schemes, including considering measures that address stretches of the route where safety issues are of greatest concern and the pinch points that he talks about, outputs from that work will then feed into priorities for future investment strategies.